Hi, I'm Donna Wolf from Nastasia.com. Today, I'll show you how to crochet my sweet, simple butterfly. To do this, you'll need small amounts of Red Heart Baby Hugs light yarn and a size G hook. Also, be sure to click on the subscribe button to get notified of new videos from me each week. To begin, make a slip knot and chain six. Slip stitch to the first chain. Chain three, which counts as one double crochet. Make two more double crochet stitches. Chain four. Make three double crochet stitches. One, two, and three. Chain four. Make three more double crochet stitches. One, two, and three. Chain four. Continue around until you have eight sets of chain spaces. By the way, if you're on social media, you can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. At the end, slip stitch into the first stitch. Count to ensure you have eight chain spaces. Connect your new yarn by making a slip knot on your hook. Slip stitch into one of the spaces. And chain three. That counts as one double crochet. Make four more double crochet stitches. Make five chains. Slide your stitches over so they fit. Make five double crochet stitches. Two, three, four, and five. In the next chain space, make five double crochet stitches, followed by five chains, and then five more double crochet stitches. Slide your stitches over. One, two, three, four, and five. Continue with this around. At the end, just slip stitch to the first stitch. Connect your final color like this chain three, which counts as one double crochet. This time we're going to make a total of nine double crochet stitches. Followed by a chain two. And then nine double crochet stitches. Make a single crochet in between the large shells. And in the next space, nine double crochet, chain two, and then nine double crochet stitches. Single crochet in the next space. Continue with this around for all eight sections. Slip stitch to the first stitch. Look for four of these large petals and fold it in half like this. Lay your butterfly down and use a chenille stick like this to finish it. Or you can take a chain and tie and knot it on top. And here are my finished sweet simple butterflies. I hope this video has helped you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like and comment on this video Check out the video's description and the info button. 
Also, this video has both closed captions and auto-translated subtitles. And please visit Nastasia.com for more tips and tricks on creative, self-sufficient living.